Hey guys, look, I got my little frog fountain going. <laughs> Isn't she cute? Well, I just went to the greenhouse. We have a greenhouse down the road and I got into some trouble. <laughs> I got, um, I'll show you what I got. I got these really cute um, Gerber daisies. They're yellow, I love yellow. And then I got these two little euphorbias to put in, I think with it, and I think I'm gonna put it out there um, in that pot right there, that white one. I just got done spray painting it. And then I got, um, this is called Plum, Plum Paisley Begonia. The lighting, sorry guys, isn't she gorgeous? God, I love begonias. And she is so, so pretty. She's a little beat up, but she's got, she's got some new growth coming in and she will do fine. And then this here one, I got another begonia. This is called Escargot. I love these. I have been looking at them online. Look how, wait, this lighting is horrible. Look at this. And it's so fuzzy on the back. Look how fuzzy it is. These are just adorable. And I think I might put, I don't know for sure what I'm gonna do with those begonias, but now I got these, I got two more banana trees and these are the red ones that I had last year. Look at that. Isn't those gorgeous? And I think I'm gonna put those on my corner I still have to oh, right here I still have to dig well I'll have to I haven't got those fencing secure but I think what I'm gonna do is I've got a hosta on each end I'm gonna take my fence out I just have it laying in there I'm gonna dig up my hostas on each side and then I'm going to put a banana tree in each corner um and then I have daisies those are my daisies I have more hostas right here my hookahs and then daisy hookah another but now the hostas need shade but once my daisies grow up they'll be shaded so um I'm not worried about that and I've got my two other banana trees I got one there and one oop, behind my fountain over here and then I've got elephant ears with them and then oh let me show you make sure I don't fall I can't see I got a red canis she is beautiful she has red leaf they look a lot like the banana trees, don't they? I love these. I love these colors. But she is red. Um, and she will get a red flower. So I got her too. My stupid chickens. They keep digging up my stuff. Oh. I got some daylilies planted in here today. We got two pine trees. We got those two. Look at my little elephant ears coming out and then I have another canvas right there and then I have look at the my banana tree has went through hell with our weather but she'll snap out of it um, I have another canvas there and an elephant ear popping up here and then my other banana tree it looks a little better and then another elephant ear Oh, I'm in my shadow. My cute little pond. I finally got her. Oh, the fountain ain't working. It was working. I wonder why it ain't now. The solar fountains are kind of junk. 
There she goes. Not very good, but I have to clean it up. And then usually I keep a few um, goldfish in my little fountain, but I don't or my pond, but I don't have any in there yet. And this is a water iris that I have in my pond. Anyways, this isn't what um, I was supposed to be showing you, but everything is coming up really good. I still got a little bit of work to do over here. Um, I'm pretty much, I've redone all this. That's a big sedum right there. And then I have, this is my ground orchid right here hiding. The dahlias. But, well, anyways, to what I bought today. So I got two of these beautiful, beautiful banana trees. Like I said, I showed you where I'm going to put them. And then I got this beautiful elephant ear. I do not know her name. But isn't she gorgeous? She's got the red stem. If anybody knows, I haven't looked her up yet, but I seen it and I was just like, oh my god. But she's got, there's a new leaf coming up right there. And there's a little tiny baby plant right here coming up and I am going to put her I'm gonna put her over here in this container I'm gonna put her in there and then she'll grow up and get big and she'll give me a little bit of shade in front of my greenhouse because this is south and um, if I don't <clears throat> have a little bit of shade here um, I have to put my shade cloth up, which is no big deal. But I haven't got a whole, whole lot done in here. Mostly it's just been cleaning. I've got a few of my orchids in here. Uh, I brought my other elephant ear out, my alocasia. I have another orchid hanging up there. I have a couple plants. I brought out my big begonia and my Brazil. My husband and I put our shade cloth up yesterday, so... Anyways, that is what we have gotten done. I painted my basket, my little chair, and we're just kind of slowly, I'm slowly working on stuff. We mowed the yard yesterday, so it looks really nice. You can see our beehives out there, and then we've got more over there. But... Yeah, I've got a few things out. Um, I still got to figure out what I'm going to put right here in this corner. Um, I've got Russian sage right there. A little fern. This all gets morning light and then it's shady all afternoon. So, yep, that is what I got, guys. I am so excited that I found my red banana trees. I get these every year. Well, I didn't last year. They didn't have the red, and I ended up with a moho, mo, moho, boho banana tree. I forget. And it was majorly green, um, with a little, with a little bit of red on it. These are my favorite. They get like uh, four, four to six feet tall, I think, which is perfect. Um. I believe the other ones that I got that I just showed you get, uh, well, they can get like 12 foot tall, but they probably won't get that tall in my area, being I'm in Ohio. But, um, all right, guys, well, I am going to let you go, and I am going to get busy digging. It is like really super nice here today, and I've already... <laughs> I've been up and out here since 8 o'clock this morning, and I was like, I've got a few more plants that I ordered coming. Um, me and I traded orchids with one of my subscribers, so I'm really excited about that. I'm getting my dream orchid. Um, I'm getting a wrinkle stylus. You guys will see that sometime this week. And then I've got a couple of more plants. Sorry, my chickens are being, you can, can you see them? 
you guys want to come out and see my ducks? Hold on, I'll take you out there. I wanted to show you, we had a storm. Look at the, we had our big um, pear tree come down. It totally destroyed my duck pen. So, took out our chicken coop and took the whole top down. Destroyed this here fence. And so now we have my ducks in here with my Vienna chickens. I have Vienna chickens. This is my crew. This is what you guys are always hearing. <laughs> Their trip. We had them all out yesterday. They were running around the yard. But that's my babies, and that's our big mess that we're in the process of cleaning up. Alright, my roosters are too loud, so I'm going to talk to you guys later. Y'all have a great day. Get outside, plant something, have fun, enjoy this great weather, and I will talk to you later. Bye.